After going down in the first match against Mumbai Rockets, Delhi Dashers are confident of bouncing back in their next match against Bengaluru Blasters. In an exclusive chat with NNI's Delhi Dashers coach Ajay Kamar talks about his team and their strengths and how balanced the team is. Every event we have a quite a balanced team where we have uh, Tonhui start with the men's singles. We have Tonhui who was the world number 11 at that at the time of auction took place. Then we have Vincent and then we have Guru Saidat. So uh, on paper, of course, yes. But uh, again, this format, as I said earlier, is very tricky format. This is. It depends upon that particular day, who plays well and you know who takes the pressure. So it, it uh, ranking doesn't count much in that. So it is very very tricky uh, format, and you can't play play around with the format of the uh, matches. Like you know, number one will play the number one only. So we have no choice in that. So only uh, thing we have in our hand is a trump where we can choose a trump match. So that is uh, the situation. And comes to the women's singles, we have Sunji Hoon, of course. Uh, in a given day, she's a, a very, very consistent player. And uh, she's competing against the Kalin Marine, Sindhu and uh, Sanan Hawal, of course. But again, again, I said, it's a team game. And uh, in a team championship, it's, it's just like a different pressure altogether. So it is not that, uh, you know, uh, you can predict who's going to, you know, she's going to be a winner or uh, how is it going to come. So it, it, is, it is something which is uh, that particular match, how to take a pressure is, a, you know, the player performs well, yeah. Of course, yes. Yeah, Tianhu is the only Chinese player who's playing for the uh, Delhi Dashers and he was the former All England runners-up and has given a lot of confidence to the team and uh, it is it is like you know, it is an asset to the team and of course he is proving that also he beat Sun Wen Hu in a very tight match so we have a, lots of hope on him tomorrow we are playing Peter Excelson so which is going to be Victor Excelson sorry which is going to be a, a big match and I hope this guy uh, will pull through that match yeah. I fully agree with that because I was a part of the few uh, Super Series tournament as a coach. I was in China Open, I was there in Indonesian Open. You know, when they play three tournaments in a row, like the first uh, tournament where Shrikant won the Jakarta Open, before that he had just played the Singha Open where he lost to Sai Praneet, and again he had to travel to Australia to play that. So it is a, it's a very, very uh, difficult for a player to perform the way Shrikant has performed. It's very difficult because, of course, physically uh, you get tired, but mentally also you're drained out. So it is a very cramped kind of, uh, uh, we feel that it's a very cramped kind of a super series calendar. So I think uh, same thing, we should have a tournament, they should have some gap for their players to uh, prepare and uh, to get back to their mental and physical strength back. Yes.